Hello everyone, how are you doing today? I'm back with another video and in today's video we have an Asus Top Gaming Laptop. These two come with a Ryzen 7 and GTX 1660 Ti. The exact model for this one is an Asus FX505D model. Now in this video I'm going to show you guys how to open it up, how to replace your battery for this model. If your battery doesn't hold I will just want to replace it and this video is for you. This applies for any FX500 series model. They all do open up the same way. So let's keep this video really short and get into it. The tools that you're going to be needing is obviously the replacement part, the battery. I'll try to get that link for you guys and I'll put it in a video description. And you will need a screwdriver set. As always, I'll recommend you guys to grab the iFixit screwdriver set. As they do have one of the best screwdrivers out there. They are made out of S2 class steel. They will last you a much long period of the time. You're going to be using a Phillips number one. You do need an opening tool. You can get the opening tool, the pro set from here. They do include the opening tool, tweezers and some few other stuff. Or if you don't want to get the pro set or you don't have the budget for that, you can grab the guitar pick. A metallic guitar pick will do the job really well. So it's pretty much the same. And so get the guitar pick screwdriver and we are set to go all you need to do is to put it upside down power it up and you will need to remove all the screws at the bottom cover now, there are two types of screws here there are short ones and there are long screws the short screws are the one in the front end of the laptop including the one in the middle the long screws are the one on each side of the laptop and the back row end of the laptop those are the long ones so go ahead and remove them and keep them in a separate pile. Also, if you guys like my videos and if my video helps you guys out, you can support the channel by clicking the like button and think about subscribing. It really helps and motivates me to make more videos, take requests and answer your questions. I really appreciate it. All right, once you remove those small ones, let's go ahead and remove the big ones. All right, once we remove them, all you need to do is open up the laptop a little bit, grab the opening tool or the guitar pick, stick it to the corner of the laptop between the top and the bottom cover, just like that. Now you wanna twist it towards inside of the laptop, just twist it towards the screen, and or twist it even better towards the outer side or towards, I do it towards the screen is better, it makes it easier to crack those end clips to open it up. Do the front end, do the sides, go all the way back to the corner. And do the right side and the left side. This is my left. You can do the back side too, or you can just Pull up the case, but I'm gonna just do the back side. You guys can see it. I'm sticking right between the top and the bottom cover right there. And I'm just gonna work myself through. And there we go. Once you remove those, just grab it and from the side and bring it up. And that's the bottom cover. Once you remove that, I made a video how to clean it up, how to repaste. Check my those videos if you want to. But in here, the battery, we're going to talk about the battery is right in front of you, right in here. The model for the battery is a B31N1726. That's the model for this one. To remove the battery, there's one screw at the bottom only. You want to remove this screw. And there's a tiny clip here. You can't lift it up, so what you want to do, you want to push this clip towards the front end of the laptop while you're pulling the battery up, and it will come loose. It's just kind of hooked clip type. Once you remove those two, bring it up, and now this battery you're going to replace, so just pretty much pull the cables, and you're just going to pull the jack. It's really soft jack, and it will come out. This is a three-cell battery, so one, two, three-cell batteries, as you can see by the cable mission one red positive for every cell and one red, uh, ground for each one of them all right 
let's say that you got the new battery i'll leave the link on my video description if you want to purchase bring down the first the jack is straight down make sure this side of the jack stays up you don't want to put this pin side that shows on the upside this way you want to align it straight and push it toward the contact and squeeze it right in there and then you want to align it right on top and then push this side down you should hear a click and put the one screw that holds it on this side all right and it is very important how you're going to charge the battery first initial charge you don't want to power on the laptop at all you want to charge put plug in the charger you want to sit and let it sit there for at least six to seven hours so it will get fully fully charged and once it's fully charged, you want to turn it on without the charger and you want to use it normal use. Do not stress or do not do any gaming. Just let it slowly drain. Just put it some YouTube channel, put some videos, let it drain slowly and gently. Just go down, don't open games, otherwise it's going to overheat. And once it went down and it went down to 10%, you want to power it off and you want to plug the charger and you want to let it sit there charging for another six hours once it's fully charged then you can turn it on and use as you wish and the last thing down here would be to grab the cover bring it straight over and you want to push down the sides real hard the back side you want to hit those tiny clicks the front side you want to grab the top and the bottom here you see that the tiny gap you want to pinch them together open it up and you see a opening in the front you want to pinch them while you push slide down the trackpad towards the front and just pinch them i'm just bringing from bottom here towards the upside here helping it out a little bit to crack it to the sides and the last thing would be to just grab the bottom screws remember the long screws go at the back to the sides and the short ones go to the mid towards the front end of the laptop all right guys and this is how you upgrade your battery or replace your battery for your ASUS top gaming in a laptop, the model FX505D model. If you guys have any question or requests, feel free to leave them in a video comment. I'll try to answer them as soon as I can. Again, if you like the video, click that like and subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. And that's it.